I asked ChatGPT to design a restaurant that could go in Tomorrowland in Magic Kingdom that would fit in with the overall theme and story of Tomorrowland but not use any existing Disney IP. Here's what it came up with. Cosmic Harvest Cafe is a futuristic intergalactic dining experience set in the heart of Tomorrowland and Magic Kingdom. The restaurant embodies the spirit of Tomorrowland where the focus is on progress, innovation, and a brighter future. The concept behind Cosmic Harvest Cafe is a fusion of space age aesthetics and sustainable farming where food is grown and harvested using advanced technology and the dining experience takes you on a journey through a cosmic garden. The backstory. In the not so distant future, Earth faces a resource crisis and space exploration has become a necessity. Tomorrowland has established the Cosmic Harvest Initiative, a program that combines advanced agriculture with space travel. The restaurant itself is housed in a sleek, transparent, and eco-friendly dome, which allows guests to dine under the stars and observe the advanced farming methods used in the Cosmic Harvest Gardens on their journey. The atmosphere. The interior of Cosmic Harvest Cafe features an open and airy design, with lots of glass and metallic accents. The lighting replicates the colors of the cosmos, creating an otherworldly ambiance. The dining area is surrounded by a living garden, with futuristic hydroponic and aeroponic setups cultivating crops like kale, tomatoes, and herbs in a sustainable manner. Robots and AI maintain the gardens and assist the chefs. The menu. The menu at Cosmic Harvest Cafe is an innovative blend of earthy organic flavors with a touch of futuristic flair. It offers a wide variety of dishes catering to various dietary preferences. Stellar Salads Options Celestial Citrus Salad A mix of fresh greens, citrus fruits, and microgreens drizzled with a tangy cosmic vinaigrette. Nebula Nectar Bowl A colorful protein-packed bowl with quinoa, roasted vegetables, and a selection of plant-based proteins. Cosmic Creations Options Astral Grilled Sandwich A panini filled with marinated portobello mushrooms, roasted red peppers, and vegan cheese. The Comet Burger A plant-based burger patty topped with futuristic pickles and cosmic sauce, served with space fries. Starlight Special Options Galactic Gnocchi House-made potato gnocchi with sun-dried tomatoes, basil, and a space-age cashew cream sauce. Martian Risotto Creamy arboreal rice with saffron and roasted vegetables. Harvest Bowls Options XO Green Bowl Quinoa and kale with a blend of superfoods finished with a lemon tahini dressing. Astro Grain Bowl A mix of grains, beans, and fresh veggies garnished with edible flowers. Dessert Options Space Sorbet an assortment of fruit sorbets with edible glitter. Cosmic Crumble, a warm seasonal fruit crumble served with a scoop of dairy-free vanilla ice cream. Beverage Options, Stellar Smoothies, a variety of fruit and veggie smoothies that are out of this world. Lunar Lemonade, a refreshing zesty lemonade with a hint of cosmic berries. The restaurant also features a beverage bar with a selection of futuristic and healthy drink options, including fresh pressed juices, herbal teas, and a variety of non-alcoholic space-themed cocktails. Cosmic Harvest Cafe aligns perfectly with Tomorrowland's forward-thinking theme, offering guests a taste of the future through advanced, sustainable, and delicious cuisine, while providing an immersive dining experience within a cosmic garden setting. Now for my thoughts. I really appreciate the backstory, although I'm not sure Disney is ready to incorporate a resource crisis story into the Magic Kingdom quite yet. The atmosphere also sounds great. It kind of reminds me of a blend between Space 220 and Living with the Land. The menu might need a touch of tweaking, but overall I think it's actually pretty solid. I especially love that it was created with sustainability in mind. We'd have to change the name of course so we don't step on the toes of Cosmic Ray's Starlight Cafe, but at the end of the day I think this is actually a pretty solid concept.